Good morning, fellow Ambazonians. I bring you revolutionary greeting this morning, the 8th of February, 2019. I'm just getting news that there has been a fierce battle in Libyalem. I reported recently from intelligence that General Buba of La Republic, the general that was fighting Boko Haram in the north, their main general, was sent to fight in Libyalem. And we have just received uh, news that uh, there was a fierce battle. The Libyalem restoration fighters were aware of their coming and uh, fighting erupted. And uh, a lot of uh, La Republic military have been sent to her and we lost a brave fighter today. Our condolence goes to the family of the fighter and to the restoration fighters in Libya. We want you people to know that we applaud your effort. You people are the bravest. In fact, we owe you our gratitude for the sacrifices that you people are making on Ground Zero to stand and defend our homeland and our freedom. Uh, also, we know that there are battles that are happening in other parts of Ambazonia. There have been ongoing battles in Gokitunja, in Donga Mountain. There have been ongoing battles in Momo. There have been battle in, uh, battles in, uh, uh, in Manu, also in Fako, and in Meme. There are battles going on in Mezam. We see this every day. We see La Republic impeding the effort of humanitarian organization like Doctors Without Borders. Yesterday in, in, in Bambili, there was an, um, the, the ambul ambulance was stopped from going to pick up a pregnant woman who was, put, who, was, uh, uh, who was in labor. And the gendarme stopped the vehicle and refused the vehicle, the ambulance from going to pick up that woman until the woman was carried on stretcher and brought to the ambulance. Fellow Ambazonians, we are facing an enemy that is determined to fight till the end. They have determined and have passed an order to kill every Ambazonian from, especially male from 11 years and above. Male, 11 years and above. Selective killing. The evil regime of Cameroon is determined to wipe Ambazonian off. They want to finish the future generation of Ambazonia. But this battle is not man's battle. This battle is God's battle. We can see how our restoration fighters, men and women, are standing in defense of our motherland. We owe our lives, we owe our efforts, we owe our hard work and everything to these brave fighters or warriors. But we want to let the world know that the people of Ambazonia will not settle for anything less than our independence. We want to let La Republic know they can hire all the mercenaries in this world. They will not defeat us. We are ready to fight this battle for 20 years. And we will finish all the Republic soldiers who come to Ambazonia. The God of Ambazonia is fighting with us. 
I am telling all the La Republic soldiers who have been sent to come and fight innocent civilians. As you raise your weapon to fight against Ambazonia, God is raising a finger against you. You will all pay the price for a senseless war and the destruction you are causing in Ambazonia. The women that you are raping, the children that you are killing, the innocent people that you are killing, you will not sleep and you will surely die. If you do not die in the hands of our freedom fighters, you will die in the hand of God. Fellow Ambazonians, I'm calling on all the people of Ambazonia, especially the people from FACO. I am a child of FACO. I'm calling on my brothers and sisters of Boya that it is time for us to arise. It is time for us to wake up from sleep. We, there is no turning back in this revolution. There is no turning back. Boya will never belong to Yaounde anymore. Those, who are, those of you who are still sleeping in bed with La Republic, those of you who are still eating La Republic money and dreaming that maybe you will return back to La Republic, it is never going to happen. I'm calling on you, my brothers and sisters, that let us come together and put our hands together and take this fight to the end. We need your help. We need you to join everybody so that together we can take it to the end. I'm calling the people of Ndian, all my Oroko brothers and sisters, please, it is time for you to wake up from sleep. No matter where you are, it doesn't matter the little you have. Let us put our efforts and our hands together and give our people what they want. Let us support our people to fight, to stay alive. I'm calling on my brothers and sisters in Meme. Please, no matter who you are, Forget about the past. Forget what about what has happened. Why you are complaining? La Republic is killing our people. La Republic is burning our villages, burning our houses. La Republic is raping our girls, our women. La Republic is killing our children. Why you are making excuses? Why you are complaining? Please forget about all these things. Our people are dying. Let's put our hands together. I'm calling on the people of Ngi. Ubumba Ngi. Ayatom Rujum. All over the world. Kwi. Bazab Mungwa. Iwurubaba. Unu. Please. Nobody should be left behind. Come out from your hidings. Come out from your holes. Talk to somebody. Get involved. Let us put our hands together and let us take this fight to Boya. The international community has heard our cry and they have started answering us. United States has cut off aids, military aids to Cameroon. The Israelis have stopped selling weapons to Cameroon. You can hear the United Nations press conferences are going everywhere. The, the Washington Post has published a main article on the front page with uh, President Donald Trump's State of the Union speech. Ambazonia, it is our time. Please, our boys, our women are being killed. Our families are being killed. All of us who are in the diaspora, I say forget about the differences. Forget about the, 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 the politics. And let us join hands together. And take our people to Boya. Let us take back our capital. Let us take back our nation. Wake up. Wake up. It is time for us to join hands together. 
and take back our country. I have a message for you, General Buba. You will fall in, 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 in Libya. Your predecessor have fallen. Some of your colleagues are falling. Your soldiers are falling. Because the God we serve is more than your God. They bring you like an expert to come and fight our brave red dragon. But I tell you, you will fall in the hands of the red dragon. This is your last battle. I am telling you, this is your last battle, General Buba. This is your last battle. So if you are wise, pack your things and leave Ambazonia. If you are wise, any soldier coming to Ambazonia, this is your last battle you are going to fight. If you are wise, pack your things and leave Ambazonia because you will not survive. Our God has heard us. The gods of the land of Ambazonia is awake. You will not go free from the destruction you are committing in Ambazonia. Let every La Republic soldier take note of this. I am talking to all those soldiers of Ambazonia origin who are fighting with La Republic. You have the audacity to carry a weapon and fire your own brother and sister. You are cursed. You will have no peace. You have been cursed. You have been cursed. Balok, now you go follow you. You are, you, you be Balok. It is time for you to take that weapon and tell Pobia that you will not fight. Pobia is sending you people to commit crimes. You will all suffer. You will die. And I'm telling you, we will not sorry you. Our restoration fighter will not sorry you because you are, you are Ambazonian. So if you are wise, come to our side. Be on our side. Turn your weapon against our enemy. Don't carry your hand and kill your own brother and your own sister. Where will you stay? Let me tell you, if you don't believe it, we will not go back to La Republic. Look, we... I am very sorry for people who still think and who still dream that this is a play. We have gone too far to turn back. This fight we will fight even for 20 years. We are ready. So wake up. Leave La Republic. Come to Ambazonia and fight for your land. Fight for your freedom. Fight for your mother. Fight for your father. Fight for your brothers and sisters. Fight for your cousins. Fight for your niece. Fight for your nephews. Fight for your friends. The international community should know that the people of Ambazonia have decided not to suffer as slaves for the rest of their lives. We will not suffer as slaves for the rest of our lives. We will fight until death to be free. We cannot be enslaved by a foreign nation. We cannot be, be, be colonized for this long. Every country is being decolonized and Ambazonia is still being colonized and used as slaves, marginalized, abused, rape, raped. We refuse to be second class citizens. We want our self-determination. We want our freedom. We want to be a people. We want to be respected as human beings on the face of the earth. We will not stop this battle. We will fight till the end. Until everyone in Bazonia is killed, we will not stop. My children are being trained to fight. Even after I'm gone, they will continue to fight if this battle is not concluded by then. So, it is best to settle the matter right now and give us our land free, in peace. Because we will win today or tomorrow. So my people of Ambazonia, my brave warriors on Ground Zero, my people them, I give Bibi Salofo una. May we be wise. May we look out on our back. May we be careful for the people the way they come around. We don't know them. May we not say these evil people them. 
They don't care into Ukwata. They try to find every way for Richuna. Men will not be very careful with them. Will not be very careful with that black leg them. At the time, will say, men will not respect with mommy and with papa them where they did for town, for village. Now then go hell and now then be una eye and una ear them. Una not treat them very bad. Una be good for them. Una protect them. For they will enemy them. I did, I am, I did talk for the youth, young people, the way they did for Ambazonia. I did tell you, if you, you go stay alive if you fight. If you say you will go hide for your dormitory or you go go hide for inside your house, La Republic will can't carry you come out and, even as they carry you come out and, for, 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 for boy for day. Now, no, she don't for they say, can you to go join your friend and fight when you go, they, there are chances for stay alive, now for join fight. Not for go sleep on that bed. Because La Republic will fight, you know, the shower is trouble. How you go manage? Just you don't you die away. They just kill you. Because it is so. If you, whether you fight La Republic, you will stay enemy for La Republic. Whether you know the fight, you will stay enemy for La Republic. Any picking where it is from 11 years, go reach up to 50. All people, them. La Republic, they kill them, especially man picking. So you did stay for house, say you go do it till the public go sorry you say you there for inside house. He go come for can't kill you. So I tell you, say may you wake up. May we na join fight. May we na make a may we finish this fight quick quick. Now know that you don't for inside house. May God bless you now. Now na secretary of defense John Egiawa na in talk. Secretary of state for homeland security. Na may I talk. Thank you, people of Ambazonia. God bless you. Long live the Federal Republic of Ambazonia.